It is so rare in this industry that you get to do something and you can say that uh, it's pioneering and it's not a bunch of hyperbole and, and you know, marketing talk. Um, and being able to work with, with Mark to create a world from day one to hold a top tier video game and a high quality television show. You know, at the very beginning, we really had to figure out what we didn't know at, or what we learned each other's process, learn how to, to speak to each other. Their development process is completely the opposite of, of a television film development process where you start with character and story and uh, narrative and they're building their sets in essence. Okay. Um, you know, art is the long lead time, right? And so for us, we really want to nail down what's gonna look on, you know, good on screen and, and what our character is gonna look like and, and the aliens and all that sort of stuff. And, and I think the good thing is there were enough big ticket items like that that, that we sort of fell into organically natural owners for different parts of, uh, as we deal with IP. So, you know, art for us, character and character development for them. For us, the crossovers between the game and the show are some of the big things that Defiance can do because we've been together since the first day and we've been working on this together and, and you know, crafted the same vision. Um, and it's where we have these big beats with every episode as it's on air where there's some massive crossover event from the game to the show and some massive crossover event from the, from the show to the game. Um, and I think like a great one's the contagion. And out of this world comes this virus and at the end of an episode, someone, we see someone die from it and then that's the end of that episode. And then you go to, into the game world. Sure, and so what, one of the characters in the show is uh, Doc Ewell and she calls uh, her counterpart in San Francisco, so also an Indigene. Um, and so now the players are doing a series of missions for the doctor in San Francisco where they have to collect reagents for the, for the cure for this nanite plague. And I think the real kicker is they have to do it before next week's episode or bad things are really, really gonna happen. And so I think that that back and forth, you know, particularly for the game player where they get to go and do this, this thing and, and create a cure and then see it on television. I, I mean, I, I, I think that's awesome. We need to leave, now. Thank you. Careful with that gem, kid. People will do anything to get their hands on it. And I mean anything. Projected impact of 20 clicks. Thank Thanks, you. Everyone. Uh, hi, I'm Adam Pally. And I'm Gillian Jacobs. And subscribe to ENTV for all your entertainment news first.